Hey everybody, in today's video we're going to take a look at how you can measure some of your geometry. Now whether you imported the geometry or have drawn it within Bobcad, whether you're working with wireframe surfaces or solids, uh, this particular particular function will work with all of them. Uh, you're going to find this under the Evaluate tab up at the top of the screen. Uh, there are a number of different options in here, but usually if I just want to display uh, some information uh, quickly about the geometry, maybe a whole size or something like that, uh, I'll either use Measure 1 or Measure 2 in order to measure the geometry directly. Uh, if I choose Measure 1, I can move my mouse over any entity. Uh, if I select that entity in the measure entity window, all the information about that entity will come up. Uh, this will, uh, in this example, uh, give me the XY center, the radius, the diameter, start, end angle, rotation, and uh, their circumference as well. So this is a very handy tool uh, to be able to inspect your geometry and find out some information about it uh, quickly in order to either validate your design or to help you with your programming process. Uh, measure 1 allows you to measure a single entity at a time. Again, it could be a surface edge, uh, it could be a wireframe, uh, line, arc, or point. Uh, measure 2 also allows you to measure between two entities. So if I wanted to find out what the distance was between this line and this line, I can select those two lines and uh, dimensional flags will come up uh, providing information about that specific geometry. Okay, if I want to do it again, I can just hit measure 2. And again, uh, I may want to check a different uh, distance. You know, I may want to know what the distance is between here or here. Uh, in the, the background, it's actually measuring X, Y, and Z data, and the flags will tell you uh, what that data is or what those locations are. Let's look at a different one. We're going to click measure 2 again. We'll hover over this arc. We're going to grab one of these locations. We're going to scroll down to this next one. We're going to grab another location. And again, we're able to measure between uh, those two snap points on the screen.